Hey Magic Me on YouTube, T1 Glistener Elf here. As you can see, I'm exactly one win away from advancing up from Platinum to Diamond, and it'll actually be the first time I've moved up to Diamond. I don't play this game as often as I would like, and I'm a free-to-play player. Uh, a lot of that has to do with work, but right now I have a moment, and I've been on kind of a bit of a streak, so I'm going to try to push myself uh, all the way through. So just really quickly before I get started, I guess I should show off the list. Uh, it's the same thing as last time. It's the, the four creatures are All Seed of Life's Bounty, uh, Selfless Savior as our one drops, and creatures that protect the actual ones that matter, Core Spirit Dancer, and Srom Senior Edificer. It's also a Lurus deck, of course. Uh, and so all of these are going to cost one or two CMC. We have uh, Cartouche of Solidarity, Sentinel's Eyes, and Curious Obsession for our one mana auras. And we have All That Glitters, Ether Tunnel, Cartouche of Knowledge, and Staggering Insight. Actually, as our two drops. So, this is weird. When I do speedruns, Ether Tunnel is what I include because it's faster. Since it can sneak by, it can end the game sooner. But Staggering Insight gives lifelink, so it gives us something to do against aggro decks that keeps us in the game. And it draws us a card, so it makes us more consistent. Um, and it improves the toughness for whatever difference that makes. Uh, yeah, so that's, and then the one Castle Ardenvale, ten planes, four Glacial Fortress, four Hallowed Fountain, and a Temple of Enlightenment. Uh, the one temple is just to have yet another blue source, try to make ourselves cross that threshold. Uh, and yet yeah, comes in tapped, but at least it scries, which we can do before a draw off of Sram or Core Spirit Dancer. Uh, this is for best of one, so there's no, not a sideboard aside from Lurus. And let's jump in. The quest is 20 white or green spells, so let me, uh, I, I played Vintage previously against Green Sky Dragon and made a, a big misplay in game one. I would have lost anyway, but let me have some caffeine to keep me in here. Ooh. I mean, okay, we'll, ma we'll make it work. If we lose the SROM, we'll still have an all seed. Hello? Hello. Hello. Yeah, so maybe this thing will live. Maybe. Aha, okay. Cool. Well, before anything else. Aha! Okay, well, that was quick. That was quick. We get to go from Star Platinum to uh, Crazy Diamond. <laughs> star Platinum! <laughs> now we are uh, officially... Shine on, you Crazy Diamond. How do you like the Abraham Lincoln look? This was not intentional, but I kept the beard but trimmed... I didn't shave the mustache off, but I trimmed it, and I trimmed it too much. So, to me, it looks really uneven. Anyway, so now that we're at Diamond, what does that grant? It grants us an extra pack of cards. Uh, and I guess I can try to push towards Mythic as well. I still have 21 more days to go. Um, but yeah, Diamond gives you an extra pack. This should still be, yep, still a thousand gold, still two card styles. And if I work my way up to Mythic, I get an extra pack. I have a sneaking suspicion I'm not going to be able to make it up to, like, Mythic number one or anything like that. Uh, but, I mean, I guess I can try, right? Let's, since we have absolutely nothing to lose at this point, let's just go for it. Why not? Uh, depending on... We'll, we'll see how, how long I play through today. Uh, this deck is the closest thing that I can find to Infect in, uh, in Historic. Kind of. I, I can think of two decks that... I guess Pummeler is actually closer. Kind of. It's expensive, though. We'll make it work. Yeah, we'll make it work. All Seed, All That Glitters is a 3-3 lifelink, so if nothing else, we'll have that going for us. So let's move these over. Don't die. I mean, it's, it's an island, so we'll see. What you got? What do you have? Ah, okay. 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 I 
think that I can live with that. Now, obviously they see that I'm missing a color. I, I wholeheartedly agree with their decision there. So we will play out the sentinel's eyes, put it on you. I mean, I am giving this away, but they have black mana out. I'm going to force them to have something like dead weight, some, or disfigure, some weird card like that. Make me sacrifice it? That's a thing. Well, no, because I have self the savior out. Hmm. Murderous Rider. Yeah, uh... No. I mean, I have to make them do it. Uh, let's see. <sighs> do we even worry about the SROM? Well, regardless, let's hit them for a little bit. I guess we do. It's either SROM or Luris here. But as of right now, yeah, let's do Luris actually instead. Uh, since I don't have something that I can cast with SROM anyway. Aha! Okay, okay. Well, eh, that happens. That happens. Graft Digger's Cage. Yeah. Interesting, they put way to- oh, well, no, no, that's right. They, uh, they didn't know they were going to have it at the time. Uh, let's put Curious Obsession on you. Alright, fire. What do we have? Okay, um... Hmm... Let's, uh, divide and conquer here. Okay. I definitely want to do that there, because if they're able to kill my creatures, something like Languish, then uh, that gives me a draw to get through closer to my next creature. What is this deck? I Grix is control, but what exactly is going on here? Alright, so nine. I can put you out here. Oh, they do have something they can do at instant speed, as it turns out. Ah! I'll give them the nice on that. That's good. That's pretty good. Alright. Let's see. Ah, there you are, right on time. Okay. Get an extra CAD. Yes. Alright, so we should be alright here then. Should be. Thirst for meaning for... Cry, okay, okay. Dropping the cry. A little too late there. A lot too late there. Actually, since it's a sorcery, they never had a chance. I was able to put well, never had a chance. I was able to play Srom and then get both of them out of range. So they did have a chance. Uh, okay, let's keep going. Keep the caffeine flowing. Hmm. I am seeing a present that I got Evangeline. Oh, she is the biggest Sonic the Hedgehog fan in the world, and she wanted to be able to play uh, games with me. So I got her a controller. It's since you can put it on your computer. Got her a, and it's a small enough controller that her tiny little hands could handle it. Kind of like the Rock Candy controller that I got her. Uh, although even smaller than that, and it has Sonic on it. Ooh, I, I see a problem with this. I think it's... Uh, this doesn't feel good, to be honest. Especially since I'm going first. I'll mull. Okay, I'll keep. Keep. Drop you. Alright. I'm glad for that decision. Just... 
too slow. When the one land you have, you have one land and it comes in tapped, it, that's just too slow. We don't have to give away our second color just yet. Alright, fire. It might make a difference if I find, like, Hallowed Fountain, Curious Obsession. Maybe. Alright. Here goes, well, okay, there you go. Alright. They don't have something that one mana that they can play here. Hmm. Oh, I could have played Core Spirit Dancer, Curious Obsession. Ah. Yeah. Oops. Wait, 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 wait. Why am I doing this now? Enter. Yeah, we def if we don't find a land next, we want to have Spirit Dancer Sentinel's Eyes. Because if we do Spirit Dancer Obsession, we'll lose the Obsession end of turn. Okay, um, All right, let's get some even more cards. There's Cartouche of Knowledge, a little bit light. And the inability to find another land's a bit annoying, a little bit. We'll make it work, though. Let's see, just off of this we have Sentinel's Eyes, Cartouche of Knowledge. Let's see. There's Marvel, but they don't have nearly enough energy right now. Alright. Yeah, that might very well be the good game. Alright. Hut up. And yeah, playing the land early there is not correct, uh, but since I was pretty sure that's what I was going to put in anyway, yeah. I should have played another one just to complete the quest a little more quickly. Yeah, this deck is, is silly. This is what it's been like for the past few days that I've been doing this. This is how it's been going. I'm just playing Infect over here, but with Auras, <laughs> and no Karametch's Blessing. I did at one point hatch experiment with Karametch's Blessing, and I don't know that that's where I want to, uh, after the next win, we'll open a pack. I don't know that's where I want to be. It's just too slow. Uh, I have to give up some number of, probably auras, because we're keeping in Selfless Savior. We're keeping in All Seed. We're keeping in Strom and Spirit Dancer. 20 lands is as low as I think I can go in this deck. Hi, Alf. Yes. Even if the first one dies, the second one can live, hopefully. That's the plan, anyway. That said, we don't have mana for an actual aura just yet. So the pronunciation that I have for the word A-U-R-A, -A, a lot of people around here say A-U-R-A, and I say A-U-R-A, but it sounds like I'm doing a Star Platinum impression from JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. <laughs> well, that is kind of what the deck's doing. Aura, 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 yeah. Yeah. If I did have to cut a land in order to make it work, or not a land in aura, I would probably have to be. Let's see. Uh, it's either Ether Tunnel or Staggering Insight. Alright. She knows. Good grief. Well, I see a basic planes and I assume that we're. Yeah, we're gonna make it. Spear Dancer's going to make it. Ah! Gotta watch out for that wrath, though. So let's not play the second Spirit Dancer, then. Let's wait. That seems like it could go poorly, if I'm not careful. It does mean we're giving up a little bit of speed. All right. But, if for whatever reason they still have targeted removal in a deck that's clearly signaling uh, not targeted removal, <laughs> signaling Wrath of God or Settle the Wreckage, then I guess there's that. Oh. Oh. Okay. 
Core Spirit Dancer. You better. Yep, okay. That is correct. I'll still get to draw cards off of it, though. So it's not the end of the world. If I had known that... Well, I mean... Isn't that always how it goes? We're gonna wait on Srom as well, I think. Well, you know... Hmm. We're more likely to be able to get lethal next turn if we play Srom here. Right? Oh no, wait a minute. No, 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 we have lethal next turn just through all the glitters because of all the other auras that are already out. Ah, right on time. Selfless Savior, a turn too late. Here it comes. Here it comes. If I'm wrong then we'll be, we'll be fine. All right. Well. Well. Settle. All right, do you have it? Yep, settle the wreckage, okay. As expected. So they're tapped out, so this part doesn't matter too terribly much. But we'll go Selfless Savior, just in case. And then Sentinel's Eyes targeting you, since Selfless Savior can sack. We want to leave that utility on the table. Uh, I don't suppose that it matters too terribly much. They're at five? Yeah, let's get another Sentinel's Eyes out. This is lethal. With the Selfless Savior. Alright. In turn. Let's go. I'm so sorry. Oh, it's not lethal any... There's nine lives. Okay, it's definitely not lethal now. It's about to say it's not because of Castle Ardenvet. Ah. Ah. Good game. I cannot beat that. In the deck as it's currently constructed, I cannot beat that. I don't have uh, removal. Well, that happens. I did say next win, so after the next win, we'll do it. Obviously, in hindsight, it would have been better to uh, play out the second Spirit Dancer, but I think it made sense to play around Wrath of God. Uh, Alternatively, I could have played the second and only put them on a single Spirit Dancer to play around Settler Wreckage. Um, that could have been done as well. I think that they're both probably four ofs in a list like this, so I don't know that there's a great way to decide which one is correct. It's a weird itch like inside of this side of my nose, so that's not fun. Alright, yeah, um, only one... Aura, but that's okay. We'll make it work. They're going first, so at least we'll get an extra card. Uh, they're Graph Digger's Cage. Okay, I mean, it is a Lurus deck, so I guess I can't blame them. I suppose. <laughs> Alright. Uh, here comes Sensor. What you got? No? Okay. Well, let's run it in, or run it into the sensor, and if it doesn't work, we have another. It does work. Okay. I dare you. Try to kill it. I dare you. Yeah, we're, we're, we're doing this. Because you're worth it. It's a L'Oreal commercial. You, you see how long my hair is? I should be a L'Oreal model. I mean, they might as well make me do it. Insert extra kill spell hill here, like eliminate, search, okay. And let the feast begin, I suppose. Alright. Um, 
You know, in this case we could play the Cartouche instead, but I think it's better to play out the Selfless Savior. Cartouche would give us a little bit more damage, and it would still give us a creature, but Selfless Savior works around, uh... Wait a minute. Damnation is a card in this format, right? I know Languish is. I know Wrath of God is. I know it was a card in Amonkhet Remastered. Well, in Amonkhet. It was one of the invocations. Hmm. Oh, good grief, Jay. No, I don't think it's... I don't think it's in Historic. Extinction Event. Uh, yeah, can't help that. Can't help that. That'll do it. Whale? Okay. We can dump them into the Selfless Savior. Or, we can do this. All right. Let's build that board. Build that board. Build that board. All right. Poke for one. Pass turn. Yay, they gained life. Woo! So Erebos gets to do a little bit of Heliod's intervention with that ability. Instead of gaining twice life, you gain X life. Ah, Huh. Well, there's already a Graph Digger's Cage out, so there's not really much of a point in letting the Selfless Savior not get exiled, but I guess just in case. No, there's not anything that I can do there, actually. Hmm. Okay. Hello? Alright, here goes nothing. We might only have one more shot at this. I think that's the first time I've actually seen that card in play, though. That Field of Ruin's going to mess up Castle Ardenvale if that shows up. Otherwise, that'd be nice. Ah ha! Okay, I mean, at least we get to draw a card. Hmm. Name Luris. Bird in the hand, right? And even if I have a bunch of cards in hand, if I can't actually... Yeah, Core Spirit Dancer. Oh, okay then. Huh. I get to draw four cards, right? Wait, 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 wait. What's the wording on this? For each exiled from their hand. Okay, okay. Fair enough. It's not each exiled. We're good. We're good. Okay. And pop it. Curse you, Graph Digger's Cage! Alright, what's that? Drown Cat Cone. Okay. Huh. Ooh, Ashiok. That's not good. That's not good. And then I have to exile a card. That's the one. Hmm. Okay. Well, that's a little annoying. Pop. Draw a card. Alright, I guess we'll play this out. Do these, th these things don't fly? Mm, nope, they do not. Attacks or blocks. Interesting. Alright, so they have three mana after this. Thought Seize. Ooh, I like that. I mean, they know what's in my hand. You take the all that glitters, right? Ooh, okay, there's Ardenvale. Huh, okay. So, Curious Obsession requires that I deal damage to a player, so it's a little less valuable now. But, I'm about to just play everything out here, actually. I think that that's right. Just play absolutely everything. Alright. So, they'd have to give up Ashiok, which means we want to kill Ashiok here. Bang. 
It's a little unfortunate. Now I'm going to be left with no cards in hand. There it goes. Alright, let it resolve. Uh, as expected, they went and did it. I mean, we are in diamond now. I can't expect misplays. That thought sees is sadly kind of stranded in hand, though. Oh my goodness, you stop that. That's probably good game. Probably. Oh, especially without the Arden Veil anymore. Ah! You win 0% of the games you can see, right? Let's keep it going. Uh oh. Although this isn't great. Thought sees me. Ooh. That's really not good. Hmm. I can't put Cartouche on my opponent's creature eat to create my own. All the Cartouches say, creature you control. Yeah, this is uh this is scaling out of hand awfully quickly. Without paying their mana cost. Yep, okay. All right, it's dead, Jim. I right, just kill it. Just kill it. You have you get to choose whichever way you would like to kill it. I guess for style points, I could have sacked it. Hmm. Ooh, take out all the wing cons. <coughs> I refuse to concede, although there is exactly zero chance with Fatal Push and... Yeah, now I actually can't win. Now it's actually not possible. I'll give him that. Yeah, no matter what cards I have, uh, I draw. That won't do it. Okay, well, as soon as I say <laughs> this is how it's been going, you get bumped down twice. The arena is serving me a dish of humble pie, right? Let's try that again, though. I did say it opened packs after another win. We have uh, Zendikar Rising, M21, and maybe there's something else in there, too. Maybe. Maybe. Well. I guess it does get a little bit harder to find people in Diamond. There aren't as many of us, right? Although, I've played you in Platinum a good bit. Good to see you up here. Yeah, let's go for it. If I find another land... It'll be, it'll be okay. We have Lurus, after all. Ah, okay, it's Gruul, right? Let's see if we can make this work. Shock. If they had Shock, they would have held it up, though, right? Ooh, okay. Well, no matter what, at least we get a draw. Alright, Cartouche first. And we get it. Okay, cool. We get something, at least. In that case, let's see if we can gain some life. Brazen Barber. Perilous Voyage. Huh. Okay. Oh, boy. Yes, we still get to draw. Hey, keeping us okay on cards sounds nice. What is this shimmer? Oh, I know what this deck is. 
This is Neoform. This is Neoform. Pop. Add it to you. Well, okay. Find a one drop. No, that's not a one drop. That is definitely not a one drop. Alright, so how quickly we, can we uh, get this out of control? Uh oh. Oh, Paradise Tree. Okay, we're not dead yet. We're getting really close, I feel. Alright. So that means we have to put the uh, Ether Tunnel up. Okay. Yeah, I, I'm eschewing the other Spear Dancer. I should put all that glitters on... If I put it on the little dude, then they're less likely to block and I'll get to draw a card. Yeah. We can present lethal next turn anyway. Never mind, it's a wall of blossoms. Of course they're going to block. Jay, you genius. You idiot. You idiot. <sighs> what on earth are you doing, Jay? It's okay. It's okay. Alright. Well, moment of truth, I guess. Do they have it? Yep, here it goes. Here it goes. I'm going to make them do it, though. Alright, so it didn't make it. Even if I put it on the Spirit Dancer, it wouldn't have actually made a difference then. Oh, let's hit Resolve All. Alright, so there's one. One joy of this deck, though, is that they have an awful lot of dead cards. So, sometimes they can brick. I don't think that that's what's happening here, but we can hope. One can hope. Is this a glass pool? Yeah, okay. Yeah, I have a sneaking suspicion that the uh, defender is not in their hand right now. It could be. Nope. Tuck, tuck, rubble for it. Alright, so they had everything except for one of them. Uh oh. Okay. Oh, fun. Oh, what fun it is to write, yeah. Alright, so this is... 18 here. Yeah, we, we lose. There's not a way that I can do this. It'll keep us in, unfortunately. If I had been able to stick the lifelink from Staggering Insight, that would have been convenient. Oh, well. Oh well. Well, we can't go we can't drop down. We can't go any further down at least. Once we hit diamond, once you hit a new uh, mineral, you're good. Metal or mineral. Or mythic. I swear, th I get the first three and then I lose the next three. The the trend the trend the way I was able to get here was banging them out pretty quickly one after another. Uh, it'd be nice if it could show me some of that love again. Sin slupfer. Slupfer. Sure. Keep. Alright. Ooh, a mulligan. Okay. We'll take that. Godzilla sleeves. Isn't this supposed to be the Walking Ballista secret layer sleeve, I think? Hmm. The fact that we're missing a color is not great. Bomat Courier. Ooh, okay. I think we can make this. I, I have a sneaking suspicion we can do this. Uh, 
Um, if they're blue and they have red, I'm going to play it a little safely here. Let's put out the Selfless Savior and the All Seed. And then we'll have all that glitters cartouche out. Let's see if we can make that work. Alright, what you got? Hope of Giraper. Until your next turn, target player who is dealt combat. Okay. Can't cast non creature spells. That's actually a problem. Or it can be. Alright, you'll attack. Put another one on it. I'm actually tempted here to block with all seed and have selfless savior give it indestructible. Ooh, yeah, about to say, it'd be nice if I could do this though. Alright, how would you like to respond? Nope, okay. Do we find out now? No, they're still, that's right, they're still face down. Okay, so that happened, I guess. Uh, in that case, well, I guess let's just fire this off as soon as possible, right? And go. Who's bigger now? You gonna block? Okay. Fair enough, I guess. Just out of curiosity. Curiosity's sake. Alright. Ah, okay. Hey, buddy. Good to see ya. Alright. Even bigger. I am now all of the huge. Not yet. We're getting there, but not yet. Um... Hmm... Hmm... Okay. Put it on the Vigilant creature, I guess. Share the love a little bit. Alright. Cool. Cool. Go to 33 against what appears to be an aggro deck. Albeit a silly one. And this doesn't require mana to sack. Ooh! I do not have mana right now. That is a... They didn't pop it when I was tapped out. Uh, sure. Thank you, kind stranger. Hmm. How do we want to do this? Put it on the first strike vigilant creature, I guess? I mean, it, it doesn't have lifelink natively. <sighs> I mean, it should have been returned to hand, and I should have had the... Uh, I should have had this be my only play right now. Alright. What you gonna do? At least if I want to keep holding up all seed, that would be my only play. Alright. Bang. Draw a cad. And that's not a may. I just do it. Alright, I think we're alright. I have a sneaking suspicion that they're not going to be able to uh, fire off a wrath here. Alright, just drawing a card. What is this? Yeah, maybe they saw what they messed up. Alright, well, promise is a promise. Let me go open some packs for us really quickly, and then we'll jam some more. Hmm. What's next? Oh, and I guess we got a new card style as well. Ah, alright. So, 2021 first. Oh, okay. Now I have two rares. Oh! Oh, and another Lofty Denial. I'm running, I'm playing a deck where I have three and could use a fourth. 
Crashler is also in that deck, but that's a four of already. Okay. I'll open one Zendikar Rising pack for now. We'll open the rest later. Ooh, that's a good one. I am A-OK -okay with that. And then, and Deliberate. I'm good with that, too. And let's head to the store. See if I can finally get that. I lack one Triumph. Maybe, just maybe, I was going to get this one anyway. And then after I get a few more wins, we'll open the other Zendikar pack. I mean, we're only 40 minutes in. Song of Creation. I believe my fourth, so I guess I could go for that combo deck now, if I feel like it. If I uh, just want to live by the RNG and die by the RNG, I guess I could. Alright, let's see. Let's keep going a little bit more. I get two more wins. Go for two more wins. Hmm. I forgot to check uh, if the person who con well no they didn't concede to me immediately in game one. High power of evil. Uh, I try to check when people auto concede against me to see if I might know them. They might know me. But in that case, that wasn't an auto concede. That was. Uh, them not being able to play from there. Alright. Hello. Okay, hi Marvel. Wins Marvel. Big fan of MVC2. I basically don't know how to play the game, but I love watching it. It's a joy to watch. Let's do uh, Curious Obsession first. Okay. Cool. And then you. I'm not going to use my mana quite as if. Oh, no, it works. It works out. Play the selfless savior. Protect. He protect. What is it? He, uh, he attack, he protect. But most importantly. I'm trying to think of something that would rhyme with that. He thick? I don't know. Thick dog. No, that's not right. He, he dumb as a brick. There we go. Oh, poor thing. Alright, this is the really expensive Maze of Ith. Okay, I think we'll be alright. Oh, I thought they had some trick there. That would have been funny. Alright, well... Let's do this. All right, get you three. What you got? Still haven't found another creature though, so um, we'll see. Because of the ether hub, if they find a white land, ah, uh, nope, they didn't. Okay, cool. Maybe it was like it could have been languish, but they're way out of range for that. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Well, there's one. Zenith Flare, again. Alright, I already have my playset of Zenith Flare. So I think we're good. Oddly enough, I don't have any copies of Fight as One unless I just picked one up from that last pack. I don't think I did. Faya Ballard. Okay. I see what you did there. Uh, it's not too terribly explosive, but we'll keep it. Turn one all seed, turn two... See what they do. It's a Lurus deck. Ah, it's Pyro... It's, uh... It's the pyromancer e deck. Alright. Probably should have led with the Selfless Savior, actually. Because if they kill it, I'm in trouble. Oh, well, okay. Yeah. What do you think? What do you say? We'll go Castle Ardenvale. Let's try to play around that as much as possible. We can put it on you. And attack. And since we have so many creatures, thankfully that'll make it a little bit easier to play around Priest. A world it can, anyway. I shouldn't say it will, but it can. Ah, I hate you. I hate that card. Alright, doing it now? 
Yep, okay. That's fine. Ow. Alright, but at least they get to draw a card. Okay. No Witch's Oven yet. I'm sure we'll get there. Soon and very soon. So we need to play another All Seed. We need to play another creature. Hmm. This is going to be... I mean, I'll take that. That's big enough. Oh, you genius. You genius. You idiot. You idiot. It's summoning sick. Even though that is probably a better distribution in general, not in this case. And they get to take control of it. You genius. And it's actually getting bigger. That's not good. Alright, we have to take the hit. Take the swing. And it gets sacked along with the scrounger. Oh boy. I don't like where this is going. I don't like where this is going at all. And it doesn't even come in tapped. I guess that's fine. Okay. There it goes. Rip. Rip. Ripperoni. And there's the witch's oven. And there's a cauldron familiar. Yeah, they got me. They got me. I had to think about that for a sec. That's not great. Puts us back down. Ah. Come on, this is not the direction I need to go. Although, this is perhaps how you would expect it to go. So you expect the average player to win about as often as they lose. You know. I'd like to think I'm a little better than average, and this is a fairly small sample size. And, I guess that same logic could be applied to Platinum, but I made it to Diamond, so... Huh. No. Yes. Alright, let's work it. Give him the hello. Jeez. Mm, Uh, in those colors, I want to play this out so that if they kill it, we'll be alright. We'll have something going for us. Bang. Alright. And then next turn, we'll try to put something onto Staggering Insight, I suppose. Or Staggering Insight on the Vigilant Creek. No, nope, no, nope, we're not. We're doing this instead. We're doing this. Alright. Get there. Get there, Spear Dancer with the Selfless Savior out. Okay. Ah. There we go. Alright. All right. Do I want to tempt fate here? Get another Spirit Dancer out. I shouldn't. Just in case they have a wrath or something, I shouldn't. Oh, okay. Well, this is not working out. <coughs> this is not working out. Oi, oi, oi. My goodness. Okay, hi, Nissa. Alright. Okay, breeding pool. So that's fine. No blocks. Puts us back to where we started. All right. This lets them hold up uh, cement growth or a uh, growth spiral. There we go. If I had a one drop, I could go spirit dancer one drop. Don't think that's an option though. 
Not quite. Okay. Get a couple draws here. Ah. Sure. Bang. That's okay. With all that glitters curious obsession, we actually have lethal next turn anyway, so it's fine to take her out. Plus, we're not worried about wraths with a selfless savior. And they only have the one white mana anyway. Since, uh... Since, uh... Arenas are in er, the shuffler isn't in their favor, right? Okay, do it again. Might as well. Oh, so they only have one blue here. And I don't think it's for unsummon. I'm gonna go out on a limb and say it's not for unsummon. I won't say good game yet. But I think we're good. I think we have this. Let's go. Oh, baby, let's go. Yeah, that's good game. That's good game. Just let me draw some more cards, please. Alright. One more. One more. Okay, actually, I'll, I'll open some packs, and then we'll get back to it. I believe I have four left, so I can do two, and then two more later on. Let's see. Now here he's lithoforming. Oh, okay. Uh, can I trade that for a good rare? Alright, well we did get another rare at least. Nimble Trap Finder again. I think that Arena's trying to tell me something. Like how it kept giving me Sanctum of All so that I'd play Shrines. I think it's trying to tell me something, because I have entirely too many of you, which is to say, I have more than one of you. Uh, okay. Sure. While I'm here, I guess we'll drop by the mastery tree. Shake a limb or two. Uh, shake a limb. Eh, we'll do this one. For now. That should be alright. Ta-da! Don't worry, we'll get to the rest soon enough. Alright, keep going. Bitchy nose, good grief. Good grief. What I should do is get up, get a tit. Oh, hi, Faya again. That didn't take long. Also, you look a lot smaller in your avatar that time. Oh. I don't feel lucky. Okay, that's good. Good. Good, good, good. Um. Is go up, get a tissue, so that I, I can just get rid of that once and for all? That would probably be the smart thing to do. Another priest. Uh-oh. Well, let's draw like mad. As best we can, anyway. Let's draw like mad. In this case, it might make more sense to put them on the all seed. Maybe. Maybe. Let's find some more creatures, please. If nothing else, we have Luris as backup, at least. One downside to doing this, however, is I, uh... Uh-oh, they can double block Srom, but they won't. They won't. Is that I'm now incentivized to uh, discard the Srom. I'm incentivized to discard my card advantage card. So this may... And I don't have all C to protect it, though against this deck, that's not really a thing. <laughs> that's not a thing. All right, so claim the firstborn. No, butcher. Uh oh. Uh oh. They can sack it. Okay. Why do they always have it? They always have it. T 
to be fair, expertise does make that a lot more likely. Unless I get something really substantial as a top deck here, we're in trouble. Uh, we're just going to have to add Luris to hand. Hallowed Fountain tapped, add Luris to hand. Cauldron Familiar, okay. Alright, good. That second one was not a uh, Witch's Oven. Alright, well we have Castle Ardenvale too. Not that that helps us too much. Especially if they do find the oven. Ow. It's just getting bigger. That's what she said. Okay. Uh oh. Oh no. We're dead. Yeah, we're just dead. <sighs> yeah, that was cool though. That was cool. Good on them. They didn't even have to sack the other one because of the Dreadhorde Butcher trigger. At least we're playing an explosive deck. When it goes off, it goes off. So at least we have that going for us. Alfredo again. It's small world after all. Alright, once again though. I don't have any one drop auras though. So if this doesn't work, I'm in trouble. Minimal. Okay. Sure. Alright. Come on, work, baby. We'll see. Spirit Dancer or Srum will be determined, yeah, based on which one they play. Uh, so let's do Spirit Dancer. Now, I still actually need to find blue mana here, though. Or not. I could do this instead. I mean, I guess that that works. Counter. Uh oh. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, why is that main boardable? It's because it deals with any creature, it's just that. Oh, you get a bonus. If it's. Uh oh. Uh oh. I see a problem, folks. They're not going to block, so might as well. Alright. We're, we're not going to be able to do this without Core Spirit Dancer. We won't have enough speed. So let's try to get it to work. Alright, Jay. Do not mess this up again. Please, for the love of God, do not mess this up again. Okay. Uh, I can't keep playing Spirit Dancers, though. We already have enough draw through these two. That should be enough to get us there. Cartouche. Okay. Ah! Finally! Finally! Can we have them dead next turn if I play Ether Tunnel here? Don't think so. Wait, it, wait, wait. Yeah, this is it. This is the way. This is the way. This is the way is, I guess, now a Star Wars meme, but... It's Knuckles. It's still a to Knuckles. Oh yeah, so we have him dead next turn. If they can't kill us here. Because we have Curious Obsession, Cartouche of Solidarity, that makes it a 12, uh, yeah, a 12-13. So, oh, a raw Neoform. This is a dual caster. Okay. Yay. Yeah, that's a thing. That is a thing. Uh, so we're dead then. Never mind. Never mind. They didn't even need the uh, Seagate Stormcaller, whatever it's called. Alright, well, what do they have in hand? Do they have Tuk Tuk? I cannot see what that is. There's Tuk Tuk. Yeesh. Not again. Jeez. For the love of all things good and holy, stop. You all stop this, right? This needs to stop. Whatever that meme is. Yeah, we're, we're very dead here, but... You know. 
I'm doing it. I'm still doing it. Ow, 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 ow. Well... Guess where we're back to. <laughs> this is... I, I hate getting wind streaks off camera, and then when I come back on camera, this happens. I can't even blame the facial hair. It's been doing this for a while now. <laughs> Arena's been doing this for a while. Unless I play a format that doesn't matter, like Mastermind, then I can go undefeated on camera because it doesn't. It's all good. Wild card. I like that name. I like that name. And, oh, there it goes. Uh, yeah, we'll keep. We'll pretend that this will work out. With that much card draw, come on, surely, surely, we can make this work. And we're going up against a deck that's going to kill it immediately. Oh, boy. Well, if they do, not if, when they do, I'll be able to have Luris out at least. No blocks. Alright. Is it dead, Jim? Not yet. It's prowess, so I'm just waiting for it. Pop! Alright. So they have something. Obviously they have something. Because they were debating doing it earlier. And don't get to draw a card. Whee! What can you do? What you can do is... Planes add Luris to hand. Planes, Luris, Selfless Savior. And then... Die. Pop. There we go. Alright. Please don't tell me you have any way to buff Arcanist. Uh-oh. No, but they can discard Shock. What is that? Maximize Velocity. Okay. They can do that. That's a thing. That's a problem. Alright. Luris, Selfless Savior. Let's go. And then if these die, I'll have all seed. Although the Luris shouldn't die uh, because of Selfless Savior. Unless I mess up, the Luris shouldn't die. There's another Soul Scar. Well, no, that's wrong because Soul Scar can put counters on it. Yeah, the way that that's worded non combat damage. Now, combat, though, we can... will be alright. Uh, interesting. Putting it on the Soul Scar Mage. I admit, I wasn't expecting that. And there it goes. Rut row. Rut row. And shock. I'm in shock. Alright, well... We don't have a whole lot left to go. Not a whole lot left in the tank. Alright. Draw. And then... Play a Selfless Savior into a Selfless Savior. And just try as best we can to get there. We don't have anywhere to go but up. <laughs> Sideways. There we go. Oh yeah, yeah. What what else could you have? Why are you doing this to me? Opponent, why are you doing this to me? What other one drops are left here? Not a beam splitter mage in diamond. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Stop itching, jeez. All right, which one is this? Yeah, I can't save it anyway. All right. Well, I would have to block with both of them. Yeah, we're, we're just dead. They got us. They got us. Ah! In order to live, I'd have to block with both of them. At least we can't go any further down. Not where I expected this video to go. <laughs> I guess Diamond's a whole new breed, right? I legitimately do find, I, I think I've mentioned this before, um, more casual decks in Platinum than I do in the... Cat, not unoptimized decks, let's say. 
Oh, hi, boss. It's not Tom Ross, I think. But, let a man dream. Alright. Give him the hello. Uh-oh. Well, no, it might be boss after all, then. Alright, please. Either this needs to live, which it won't, or I need a land for Luris, which I won't get. And it's dead. No, yes. Yes, it's still dead. Pop. If this thing makes it, oh, wow. Okay, then. Well, please, for the love of God. Nope. <sighs> okay, well, we don't get the 1-1. One, one. Let's draw a card, and it's Curious Obsession. Yeah, we're in trouble now. We didn't get a land. We did not get a land or a creature. We're in trouble. Hmm. Alright. Alright, boss. I don't like where this is going. Interesting. Wait, is that a lava? Okay. Let's try this again. Let's die to this again. Uh, and no, no lightning strike. There it is. I guess that was the top deck for you. Lava Runner, and they lose the uh, Thermal Alchemist. The Jumpstart Special. Yeah, I'm gonna say good game. Oh, should have given the good game first. Yeah, that's a bummer. What can you do? I don't think there's a lot I could do about that. Generally, this is not a matchup that I abhor, because you can usually go Turn one, play a little of one drop that can help to protect your two drop, except the one drop will die. Hopefully that'll clear the way for the two drop, and all you need to do is get it uh, above three toughness and you're usually okay. But, you know, you have to actually get to that, you have to cross that threshold first. And that was with us on the play, I believe. Chihaya, good to see you again. Okay, case in point, this is a... Uh, we're on the draw, but this is kind of what you expect. What you hope for. Okay, elves. Alright. Give them the hello. Try to be nice. Alright. What do we have? Ah, uh, never mind. Not elves. Insert hexproof-ish riot creature. No, Bone Crusher. Now. Okay, see, this is what I'm talking about. It hopefully will clear the way. Clear the way. I could have uh, held, waited and played Castle Ardenvale Sentinel's Eyes to try to make it where it, it definitely lives. Uh, I don't know that that would have been enough to guarantee it, though. All right, Ronus. Sweet. All right, Ronus the Swaggy. All right. Now we shouldn't have to worry. Now we should be good. Hi, ya. That said, if they can get this Death Touch creature online, we are going to be in a little bit of a pickle. It's Death Touch and Industry and crap. All right. Well, hmm. No blocks. Later, we can put Cartouche Solidarity to stall, so they can't attack with Questing Beast. Or Ronus, actually, because if they do attack with Ronus, then they get blown up. Uh, all right, let's see what we can draw here. Please, Blue Land. No? OK. All right, no, we win. We win now. Yep, we win. G. G. Alright. And then give it pro green. Don't have, <laughs> what, fog? Uh, 
yeah. Don't hit the wrong button. And swing. And there we go. Yeah. Alright. I'd like to keep going a little bit further. Little bit. Itty bitty bit. I'd like to get some more wins. Another staggering insight, so that's just vault progress. We already have four. Not in the deck, but I own four. I've used four previously. 220J. 220J. Uh, is that a reference to something? Opponent goes first. I'll keep this, actually. I can try to keep this. On the draw, I think this might work out. And if not, I have... Uh, there we go. I had two one-drops. Ooh, yoy, yoy. That said, we, we're still missing a color. The joy of only having nine blue sources in the deck. Alright. Uh, attack first. See if you can bait anything out. Alright, Spirit Dancer, and hope that we can get there. With Indestructible and zero mana, surely we can get there. See? We're playing in fact. <laughs> this is our blossoming defense. If I play Karmetch's Blessing, I will just straight up have Blossoming Defense. And not straight up, it's not exactly the same thing. But it's it's pretty close. <laughs> it's not too bad. Um, do I want to... No, I don't think that we need to play the Sram. I... We can, but we have so many uh, enchantments as it is, I think we're alright. I think that we'll be okay. I'm waiting for something like Coco to wreck me. Maybe. Alright. So they have some stomp, shock, lightning, one damage to each creature. If it was kicked, it deals two instead. All right, well then, let's fire this off because we have to. Uh, draw. Yep. Okay. Um. Yeah, let's just do it. Land. Yay, we found a land. And there we go. So that happens sometimes. We got somewhere. I would like to end up at least at 3 out of 6 for Diamond 4. At least by the time that this is over. Maybe. Just maybe. But, you know, I guess I could open one more pack now and save the last for two more wins. Another Shadow's Verdict. Okay. Uh... I think that makes two. It's two or three. Alright, let's keep at it. We can make this work. <laughs> if I can get another game like game one. Ooh. Ooh. <sighs> yep. See Gruel get out of range out of a uh, range of all their damage based removal. And then we're just good. Hi, someone blue. Uh, yes. Um, could go temp. Yeah, let's go temple first. Uh oh, I don't like the look of that. Um, let's try it. That may be wrong. Oh, graph digger's cage. Oh, oh, okay, that's fine. I can live with that. One, two, uno y dos. So if they happen to have rats, we are okay. We're in business. Just dump everything into one of them. Creature enters the battlefield under your opponent's control, gain one life, and they're going to come in tapped. Okay. Well, no haste for me, so I think we'll live. I'm sure that we will live. Uh, start off with cartouche for card draw. If I can find... nope. Okay, never mind. Well, hmm. All that glitters would have been better for scaling. Because uh, I could have played one here, and then if I find a land, play the other two. Solemnity. Ah, uh, we're getting... we're getting awfully close. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, dear. dear. Alright, do they have it? 
Solemnity again. Okay. Uh. No nine lives yet. Please, for the love of God. Wait, is this enough? With the all seed. It's not. It's not enough yet. Alright. Besides, they gain one life anyway. But still. Alright. Do. You. Have it. Do you have it? Crossing fingers. I don't feel like I have a lot of agency in this matchup. They either have it or they don't. Uh, did they get there before I... So I guess it's not quite Infect, right? With Infect, you can outrace stuff like that. Uh, with this deck, not so much. Alright. Rooting Moloch. Uh, I forgot that you existed. Hmm. I mean, sure. Can we get one more win in? We're not even at an hour 20. One more win would be nice. Hexproof. <laughs> Bogles! <laughs> I'm infect and they're on Bogles, right? Oh boy. Yeah, let's keep. It's at least a keepable hand. Beep, 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 beep. I don't know if the camera can see me mashing. Uh, except mash and keep seven. So that as soon as it comes up, there we are. Ah, goblins. <laughs> well, I mean, this would be the match, wouldn't it? Okay, so good news. We have our biggest creature, and we can give it flying. Uh, bad news. They start off with a turn one skirt prospector. In and of itself, that might be too quick for me. This is one of the matchups where Hushbringer used to stay in. For which Hushbringer used to stay in. <sighs> Alright. Can you kill it? I mean, if they have another Goblin and then the Cycler, Jim Palm Incinerator, then they can, yes. Herald's Horn. Oh, wow. Because the top card, if it's a creature, you may really put it in your hand. Huh. Nice. I have to give them the nice on that. That is impressive. I think. I think that's impressive. Alright. Uh, try to punish them as hard as we can and dig for Ether Tunnel. Not that we need it, we have Cartouche of Knowledge and they don't have flyers. To be fair, yeah. Okay. Come on, we gained some life. Let's go. Discard. Discard, discard. Snoop. Okay, well Snoop doesn't cost any less. Uh, because it has no colorless mana in its cost. All right, what do you have? They have enough that they could play Muxus here, though. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Is it time for the the Goblin Coffin Dance? Yep, it is. Do 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 do. God, dear God, dear God, God, why? Dear God, dear God, God, why? <laughs> All right, wait, wait, wait. If they can't kill us this turn, we we can still win. Can they kill us this turn? Oh, jeez. Okay, okay, thank you for lifelink. This is why Staggering Insight's there, because if that had been an ether tunnel, we'd have been dead. We'd have been dead. Ooh, okay, right on time, Chieftain. Right on time. Add a go add a way to go, Chief. Also, I missed something. Why did they not play the matron earlier? I definitely missed something. Did they sack some tokens to get it to come out? I guess. Alright. Pop. Alright. Draw a cat. Oh, or we could go all that glitters. Nah. Let's just stack them up. Alright, 
and then, yeah, just give it first strike. Good. Tell him good game. You did what you could, but it's flying now. It, <laughs> lifelink flying, vigilance, first strike, 15, 17. Bang. We got there. Yay, 10 wins. Woo! Yay, we st we at least crossed the halfway mark for this one. Uh, I'm going to open the last pack and, and call it there, I suppose. Just for this video. I'd say that, you know, an hour and 20 minutes of watching the same deck over and over again. Oh, hello. Hi, Michael. Michael's on. Hi, Michael. Hello. Hi. Yup. Into you. All right. Dun da 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 Nice. Hmm. So is this just instant speed hero? Ah. Okay, no, seriously. Ah excellent, excellent. I will get to put this to use in Brawl. That'll be fun. Oh yeah. Alright, um, and we earned some new wild card, yeah, some new rares. So what will I be putting these rares towards? Well, I've been needing to fill out my land base. And, uh, oh, hello. Let's go into rare lands from Kaladesh Remastered. I have two Spire Bluff Canals, and if I can pick up a few more, I might just try to show off my uh, my combo drakes deck. I say combo drakes. It's a uh, crackling drake, enigma drake, and sprite dragon. Uh, those are the creatures. What they do is that they scale the more instants and sorceries you have or cast. Or, yeah. And I already have the shock lance. I have two of these. I have one of the uh, what is it? River glide. I have one of the bimodal lands, uh, and I have sulfur falls. So, I guess I could try to pick up two more and try to add the uh, bimodal uh, is it land and try to. I mean, the deck otherwise is done. It's just the land base, and those colors will help out in a number of historic decks. Remember, in standard, I played Drake, so I have an affinity for that. But, but I did run a Twitter poll, and I asked people what they would want me to play, and. Uh, the deck that got the most votes was Hate Bears. I did forget to put Combo Drakes on, though. I did. I put uh, Hate Bears, Bant Company, and Transmogrify, uh, and Hate Bears won. I kind of wish I had included that, but people said Hate Bears, uh, so I'll, I'll be putting it towards that. The problem is that, unfortunately, I'm missing quite a few cards for Hate Bears. Uh, just looking at... Let's see... Creatures, white, uh, you know what, this, well, let's see, like Thalia, I have one. This would burn all three of mine, all three of my rares, just to get the other Thalias. Avon, Mind Sensor, I have one. Uh, you, you see the problem here, I'm, <laughs> I'm missing quite a few cards, unfortunately. Uh, but, I did say I'd build, I mean, I put up a poll, people said hate bears, I'm gonna build hate bears. I'm just... It might take me a little while to get the rare wild card scrounged up to actually be able to, to build the deck. So if it seems like that's taking a hot minute, now you know why. Sorry. Uh, alternatively, I can try to work out a land base. Uh, but I also kind of just would like to play Death and Taxes again. It, it's a deck I, I really like to play in Legacy. It's like a top three deck for me to play in Legacy. And so being able to do something like that in Historic seems like it'd be pretty cool. Just a little bit. I get to play Thalia. I get to play even Mind Sensor. I get to do stupid stuff like that. All right. And if I splash green, I get to play... Let's see... I, no, I get to play things like Knight of Autumn. And... I don't know about you, but I, I get to play Knight of the Reliquary. Like, I get to do other cool stuff, too. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, just looking at that makes me... And throw in the one, uh, you're rare. Why could you? This is the one time I want you to be a mythic, so I can actually afford you. Yeah, I, I suppose if I splash green, I get a few more things, don't I? I get some turn one ramp, 
And land of Warrior? Okay, okay, okay. I'm just... <laughs> the land base I already have? Alright. That's it for now. Take care, Magic Community, and I'll see you all later. Bye-bye!